hi guys hope you all are doing so well today so before i start this video if you have not subscribed please subscribe like and share and don't forget to click on the bell that will enable you to know whenever i upload a new video so today i will be talking about inferiority complex yes that is what I'm going to be talking about today. I've noticed that so many people have this issue. Some are looking for a way to come out of it. Why some don't even know that they are suffering from inferiority complex? Inferi the, most people don't even know that they have this issue. So I will be. I'm going. This is going to be the part one, and it's going to be. I'm also going to do the part two of this video. If you can catch a claims. Of how much confidence God has in you you will never shrink back into an inferiority complex if you know who you are if you know the thoughts that God has for you you will not allow inferiority complex to hold you back so whenever you hear a word or a thought that tell you that you can never achieve that tell you that you can that that you are not fit don't allow those words to dwell in your mind okay whenever you hear the word say to yourself that you can do all things and you can achieve whatever thing you, what you want to achieve in life if you believe in yourself you will rise up with boldness the enemy in your mind might, might tell you that you, you, you that you don't have what it takes but i want to tell you that you have all it takes when you hear that thought that will tell you that look at you, you don't have all it takes say to yourself that you have all it takes to achieve whatever thing you want to achieve in life when the enemy in your mind tell you that you will never get out of debt say to yourself that you're a lender and not a borrower okay the things are the way they are doesn't mean that you it will remain like that so don't allow the negative thoughts to control you whenever you hear of any negative so thoughts say reply to that thought by saying positive things consigning it when the enemy says that you are not going to get well tell them that what God says about it that God is restoring your health no matter the challenges don't allow the thoughts to make you to remain in a particular place and not making a move when the enemy says that you will not amount to anything in life tell them that you will do all things that you are that you can achieve whatever thing you you will achieve okay so don't allow the thought or the negative thoughts to make you to remain in a in a particular place or make you to start having depression or want to destroy yourself because you feel you are not meeting up with your friends or you feel that you are walking like an elephant and eating like an ant so don't allow those words to dwell in your mind okay make sure that you make sure that you always speak positive concerning your life whenever you wake up in the morning go to the mirror look at yourself say positive things about yourself and never allow negative thoughts to dwell in your in your life all right make make your life significant and turn your situation around and use them for your good make your life say to yourself that you are wonderful say to yourself that you can achieve whatever thing you want to achieve okay say to yourself that you would you 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 are you, you are not a negative person that you're a positive person so whatever thing that will make you to start feeling inferior i'll let it be far from you don't allow it to come close to you okay in it, in all those things i ask whose report will you believe start believing what god says about you and know what the enemy says in your heart believe what god says about you and not what the enemy says in your heart okay start thinking god's thoughts start thinking positive thoughts in, in your heart don't allow negative thought to manipulate you whenever you hear a voice that tells you that you cannot do it say to that word that you can do all things all right so by so doing gradually you will start removing that that inferiority complex from you so the second part i'll be doing because i don't want this video to be too long the second part i will be going into details by defining what inferiority complex means and how you can have how you be able to you know 
to take care of it if you notice that you are having such issues all right so you just take good care of yourself and have a beautiful and a lovely day bye